Hey guys and girls, this is Snowy and welcome to part 75 of Smiletopia in City Skylines. Now in part 74 you have seen me building up this muck place, you know, the place where we can dump all our sewage uh, without any issues and one sewage system is already uh, busy and as you can see the island has been grown over with all kinds of trees. Yes, the trees. Okay, so with that uh, problem now solved and the sewage now being uh, divided over two areas, we, can, uh, we are going to uh, focus our attention back on the campus area, which is over here. Now the campus area, let me see, I already have the university area. This is this place. Uh, let's get out of here, which is this place. University Administration Building and can I see how many stars it has already? Campus area, okay, academic year. So yeah, I gave them a grant for doing academic works, which is nice. Some, some you know, extras, you know, uh, free lunch so you can have a cookie. Always nice to have a cookie in academic works. They got a grant of 10 grand and 50,000 for, I don't know. Anyway, I know that uh, I already created uh, a camp area over here and by, you know, analyzing this uh, amount of space it needed, I think I can put a camp area into here. Now, what camp will that be? Now, let me see, uh, university, uh, now I'm at the wrong button. We already have the university campus area. We have like the trade school, uh, liberal arts, varsity sports, and museums. Now I think that these two are just additions and that only trade school campus area and liberal arts college. So let, let us, uh, yeah, let us go for the liberal arts college. Um, I think that will do nicely. and. Let us also try to create a road in there, which is just a mainly an inroad, and that's it. Um, let's do it by taking this road, which is the wrong road, okay, but we can undo it. And the only thing I will do is get the two lane one way, which is this one we are going 5u to the right we are going 4u to the top and we're going 10 no we're going it's also 5 also 5u yes like that like that and like that you know i think this is enough because uh, what space do you actually need more right you don't okay Let's get into the uh, main building, which is a uh, liberal arts administration building. That's not, oh, that's a big one. So we put it like straight here. And immediately I'm going to make some pathways because I know we need them. And let's see where we can start best. Let, let's see. Uh, I tried to do it without anarchy as uh, possible, but it's already red. So I turn on anarchy anyway. <laughs> So screw it without the enemy, and uh, anarchy. <laughs> and uh, yeah, let's get uh, let's get this up. Yeah. Now I don't know how big these buildings are, but let's keep the the space available. I'm selecting it here, and okay, here it goes. Now this is not really uh, attaching properly to the road, so I'm going to do it like that and this thing also just bend it outward a bit yes nice now let's get on with it and so what's the hold up oh the movement mod is still on now i have to find that road again and so you before you know it you are 30 minutes into the game yes okay we take this point we take it up 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 more up and let me see this is also a path so i'm taking this behind this building 
let's go up here as well and here as well let's take this also up there and this one up there now let's see what is the next building is like liberal arts okay we have these dormitories again i think it would be best i would place these dormitories as much as possible um, around the compound um, yeah so let's let's put them let's put these things uh you know all kinds of places like one over here one on this edge and one over here and one over there keep the girls and boys uh, girls and boys are separated i know they sneak in with each other every night but yeah okay what to do about it nothing can we anarchy two of these in each other? Is that possible? Or does that look horrible? Let me let me see. Let me see. It is it is doable if we use the move it mod to move this a little bit to the side so they look like sort of ah 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 the same building. Yeah, that's doable. Okay, let's uh, get us more, uh, you know, pathways to put stuff here and here. And we attach this one to there. We uh, make a road also here to there. And then this dormitory is already there, so we can create this path also to there. And I have no idea what this uh, university actually does. Uh, probably it does something with, I guess, with art and stuff. Uh, okay. Okay, let's connect that as well and make a walking road from here to here. Ah, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. Next. Uh, let me see liberal arts study hall okay let's place that quite in the center I want it to be here yeah that's the study hall liberal arts groundskeeping it's a small building we just put it like here at the beginning then the drama club okay we need always some drama in our lives, don't we? This is a nice spot for that, you know, for some drama. And so we put drama over here. And we put another drama over there. So it's one big drama. Mm. Is it too tight to the... Well, a little bit. But we can say like shift and shift. Oh, wait a second. Need to move it mod. Shift and shift. And now we select with the arrow oh oh he only takes one okay that one as well uh it's hanging over a little bit actually uh, we can select this one and this one come on both of them please do i need to select you both okay then i select you both you go to the right and down a bit yeah great now we select these now these have a little bit more space this one also now look at that look at that nice let's get back to the schools area again what is this this is a liberal arts outdoor study and wow that's a big place so where can we squeeze that in here it is not part. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is just. Mm, mm, mm. Let me see. Can we finagle this a little bit? Or is it not even needed? If I look at it, it is not even needed. I can just say with the move it mod, switch it a little bit to the left and to the to to the downside, and then that works out fine, actually nice okay let's get on uh where were we this now we are going to the liberal arts gymnasium uh does it fit here or in there maybe nah that's too big how about here 
and oh that's better that's way much better okay we put it there then we select the liberal arts cafeteria so you can grow a stomach like there and also on this side those students do like to eat a lot especially if you have a cafeteria <laughs> across the dorm <laughs> let's do it here the same okay guys you go eat at night uh, I should not forget about you guys no wait a second uh, are you both dorms I don't know uh, well anyway I just put one over here and I will put one over here and okay you eat yourself yeah okay a fountain that's like um, hmm, just a um, thing to watch you know a fountain has nothing to do with the liberal arts I mean, yeah okay maybe because a fountain is a fountain so what's this building it's a liberal arts library uh, where we're we going to put that library I think we will put that over here yeah how many buildings left still a few liberal arts commencement office mm-hmm we just put it over here yeah what is this academic statue again a statue oh my gosh do these guys even study or and one over there so what's this uh, an order what is this this thing called a liberal arts auditorium nice let's put it somewhere must, must be useful yep put it there and then we have the laboratories the buildings are getting bigger but it's okay I have the space oh, look at that it fits in perfectly in here and we have still a lot of buildings left so let's see can we squish that in here but in between we can yes uh, media lab we can put it directly above it then we have like a dance club I wanna be a hippie and I wanna get stoned <laughs> yeah let's just dance dance even just you know even uh, students want to be uh, entertaining entertained uh, what's this another statue how many statues do do these guys need it's it's like insane okay next building school of education wow that is a really huge building where to put it I can put it I can put it here but then it's so close to the road here is more appropriate yeah we will I will do it more to the top so I can put a road in between like here between that statue I will show you later and we have two buildings left Ooh, there's also a big one do we have space we 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 well well do we have space Technically, sp technically speaking, there is space in just these, uh, these paths, and then say like, and go back. Uh, my mouse, not my mouse, my hands, my fingers. Put this to there, put this to there, and I'll go back to that building, that freaking huge building, which was this one, right? yeah now can I fit it here oh, still not I will put it there I don't care because you know what because I can use it, move it more to move this around you go just there and then we move this away this away this away and yeah works also fine sometimes you need to be creative uh, what building is remaining is it this one School of Economics. Oh, that's also a big whopper. So let's see. We can. Oh, we cannot put it there because of that. 
<laughs> okay, we love to do uh, a little bit crazy now and then, but now let's have a look. It would fit in nicely in here. Okay, so what we are going to do, we take this building and we put it just like on the other side, like here. Yep, and we take this building and we put that building right here works like a charm and now this one can be easily stuffed into here I hope come on just like that and those are all the buildings thank you thank you thank you okay let's see do we have to need to do some fixing regarding the roads yes we have you have to connect to there I want you to connect to there and I think this one needs to be connected to there as well for this one. Let's make a path behind this area and that area. And I think that's it. Yeah, we can delete this path. And the only thing they require now is... Wait a second, wait a second. They require probably water and energy. But if I take this one and put it on the inside like that then maybe uh, I, I was thinking about maybe putting a canal or something around this um, structure what is the smallest one we have shallow canal uh, okay the depth depthness is not really important but it's more about the width uh, this will not fit <laughs> that will not fit Hmm, still I want something like that. Uh, what can we do? Why not just do it over again? I mean, that's more easier. You get a far more better result. Now we need a road that is as close as possible to this highway. So we are doing that, like that. And it has to connect from here uh, to this one. Can we create the same kind of curve with the highway? Um, just a sec, Maybe this part. Here's where the highway starts to curve. So it's like, okay, up until there. And then here it's the same thing. So come on, you freaking bulldozer. Uh, and here it's like, it starts there. Okay. Okay, let's take the moving mode, drag this down a little bit, a little bit, and then in theory, in theory it should be possible now to say, like, make this road, where is it, where is it, where is my road, here, this is like 20U, and this is like also 20U. I think that is not even that bad. Yeah, we we can, yeah, we can actually create a. Huh, I'm surprised. Um, let me see. There is still space around here, so. Uh, so let us. Yeah, it's getting very close to that. See that this road is a little bit meandering off towards the highway so mm, okay need to move it more a little bit like that to straighten this out like that we don't want that uh, stuff to be happening yeah okay this is until there and this we can we yeah perfect 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 okay let's put a canal around it do we have time for that? Yeah, we are on like the 20 minute mark. Mm, a canal, a canal. Uh, okay, from here. Oh man, we are, we are never getting this canal around that corner. Uh, let me see, let's put the snapping tool off. So now we have more freedom, navigation. Like from here to here. Okay. Why is that so overlapping? 
should not be so difficult to create a canal, right? Hmm. Interesting. Why is this happening? Okay, now you barely see anything of it. Oh, look at that edge. It's like, oh, okay. Uh -huh. uh, oh. Hmm. Okay. So about here, it's like, okay, uh, we can do something about this, and which is uh, where the path, path, paths, paths. And say like you go select the snapping, you go there, you go there. Delete this path. Yeah, we have space. Now we need a canal. 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 We need a canal. From there. Oh that oh my god, I will never get past by this. <laughs> Hmm. This will be interesting. Ooh, long run. Yeah. But when done, it will look uh, very nicely. Uh, it takes a little bit of time, a little bit of uh, finagling, and uh, well, let's give these guys some power so they can start up. Uh, they can, uh, you know, do something for the city. Um, Okay, so power-wise, I cannot even put these things uh, inside the city because these things can only be put to uh, roads. I never thought about that. Oh, okay, well, we can put like a few of the, those guys over here. The, yeah, they will power uh, the campus, I suppose, like these and these. But I need this space for the canal. <laughs> okay, let's remove those again. Sorry. And yeah, these maybe also. Hmm. Yeah. So, uh, they have like problems with waste. Like every main building always has waste. Okay, waste, waste, waste. Okay, let's give them something against the waste. Hmm. Here you go. Go collect waste. How about this? Mm. Mm -hmm. There must be another way to get more energy into this facility than, than just this. Um, maybe I could use a bigger energy creator, like for example, a solar power plant gives us 112 260 megawatts oh my god you know this thing is so cheap in relation towards it um, yeah maybe maybe it's an option to put this right over here and then use the underground this one nodes here and here this will all be connected now these can be put aside yes and yes and this thing should be a little bit further away like here uh, probably needs also power power wait a second here you go because now we can make a roundabout here we all love a good roundabout let's make this a two lane three lane a normal three lane roundabout and I think this is this is the correct size yes oh close and let's see here we go now let's check out this roundabout is it set properly wrong button mm, junctions let me see okay this is usually okay the traffic on the roundabout can go through the you know the junctions but i always 
turn on the pick your lane option because if traffic is allowed to pick their own lanes then the chances of uh, traffic has to do uh, having to do unnecessary lane changing will diminishing so also i will change these lanes arrows towards two to one two one two one to one so two lanes are going straight forward around the roundabout and just one is going off and these things are already set to yeah set properly so i think that is okay uh yeah about the um Ooh, this building is not connected ah uh, probably probably due to my relocation Wait, wait a second, let me redo this. Let me redo this. Come on. One, two, three, thank you. Okay, it's connected. Yeah. And is it raining? Do I see rain? I don't need rain. Come on. Gameplay. Uh Wait, 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 gameplay. Use dynamic weather? No. Use di day night cyclers? Uh, no, but the latter is on a, f a fixed uh, value, so no issue with that. Okay, so uh, how can I put this? Um, hmm. We can put this one on the other side. We can put this one on the other side. Mm, yeah, to make this canal is going to be a tough one. Let's see how far I can stretch this road. Like that, like that, like that. Yeah, the problem is the city is already that big. Is that uh, when you use the move it mod, it's like... Uh, it's not so fluently anymore. It's like uh, with hiccups. Sort of hiccups, like... Oh! Okay, let's make this road like this, okay. Now let's take this, let's see how far can we come, yeah, from here, sort of works. Then we go from here to there, also sort of works, nice. And from here to, to there works, and from here to there it works hmm interesting yeah the only question now is how do i get water into this thing <laughs> yeah that's uh that's a very valid question because i'm already looking at the map what might be a good water source yeah there is water here but uh, that does not really help that would be nice you know if uh city skylines got an I don't know, some kind of underwater pipe or something. Oh, wait a second, I already figured out uh, an idea. So let's delete this road. Delete. Uh, take this canal. Come on. Come on. Clicking 50 million times to get something done. It's like driving, you know, can drive you completely nuts. <coughs> Okay, now we bring this down with the move it mod, this area down. Now it will create a hole into the ground, which is okay. Now check it out, it needs to be at the same height, roughly as the remaining floor. You see? Okay, now let's also remove this part. And then we can create like... To be honest, I don't want such a. Uh, yeah. Okay, I want just a normal road that goes over it. Can we connect that properly? Just a sec. Is that properly connected? Yeah, sort of. Needs a little bit of finagling. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, 
Okay, so now we have this nice hole in the ground and we can use that at the, at, at the same time to create like a nice pond. So we will make this like that, that and that and we say like, okay, well, let's create a nice hole in the ground here. It does not need to be big. We can create some, some I don't know, some touristry attractions around it. Yeah, for people who can come over here and want to live here. That, that would be nice. Yeah, not such a bad idea. Okay, now to finish this off, we are cr creating a water source in here. Um, water source, water source, that's this one. Whoa, that's a big ass whopper. Okay, let's do a smaller one. Pause the game for a moment. Okay. Here we go. And there comes the water. Yes, here it comes. Now this will take a while, so uh, you enjoy the view. Come on, come on, come on. And see it filling up. Okay guys uh, and girls, I think this filled up pretty nicely and uh, so far uh, well, the level is not that high to prevent flooding. Now the main thing that is missing uh, for this campus and also for this campus is uh, yeah, it's uh, definitely public transport. Um, uh, I will allow now these cars to park here because there is no parking availability over here. This will be dealt with in episode, uh, yikes, pause, that's not, that's not good, where is this, uh, flood control system, here you are, Just a second guys, uh, I have an emergency in place. Like that, okay, you connect, uh, you connect to that, and you connect to there. Do these guys have power? I don't know, do they? They have, yes. Well, as long as this thing does not... <laughs> okay, power from here. Okay, this was a little thing that I did not anticipate. Uh, is, of course, is the, the rushing water that goes through the canal and then, yeah, it ends up here and then it's like, it floods everything. So... <laughs> oh no, the poor students. Oh no, my teacher's car is floating away. Oh, what sad. Now I have to be at home today. No problem. I will come back next Tuesday. The art of uh, coastal defenses. They have not taught them yet. But okay, you know, it's cleaning the streets, so uh, it will go. It will go away. It levels out uh, by itself. Now, what was I telling? I was telling about uh, that uh, we require public transport in this area, also for this campus. So probably a train terminal uh, here and here will do, in some parking spots. You would not say that I that that all would fit into this area, but I say it will fit. No, don't worry about that. And uh, yeah, 
And for the rest, uh, the city is still thriving uh, pretty well, and uh, I'm uh, I'm still happy with it. It uh, makes a nice profit. Um, as you can see, I also did something with the uh, the overall quality of my imagery. As you can see, the uh, roads are a bit darker. The the shadows are a bit also. Um, sharper as well the whole city looks uh, way much vibrant for example if you go all the way down you can see now that these cars also have shadows underneath them so uh, yes it, it it all became a lot more vibrant now so uh, oh yeah used a little bit of uh, finagling to get all that stuff done but uh, yeah, the, the fishery is going strong. Although this one is always complaining about not enough fish. This one has enough fish. Throw him some fish. You are you have too much. <laughs> and yeah, and well, what to say more? Um, yeah, this area is more developing uh, now. And uh, for the rest, uh, yeah, last time I did this uh, this beach heaven. I call it beach heaven and uh, make sure that this coastal defense is uh, properly set and since I created this extra protection dam we have no issues anymore. The ferries are now just going to this place. The traffic has been gone and yes you might uh, say but oh, I can. But okay I'm playing with despawning off. So guys um anyway thank you for watching i hope you uh, liked it if you have any ideas suggestions also about the campus area what we can do more with it uh, aside from flooding it with the uh, canals it's still flooding <laughs> is it still flooding <laughs> where's that thing come on get over here you get a bit lower okay if you have any ideas then uh look at this then let me know in the comment sections and uh, I will uh, have a look at it. Okay guys, thank you for watching and I will see you next time. See you. Bye bye.